some fun art. Pause and try to read things that you need. Now let's draw a zebra. Don't forget to draw the zebra line. Use a black marker to trace the line. Then put away your zebra and take another paper. Take your watercolor and put a few drops on the paper. Follow teacher Tasha. If you don't have any brush, you can use a spoon. Try to start from the middle. Look carefully and follow me, okay? When you want to start with new color, blend it with upper color. Take a sponge, ready a little bit of water, stroke on your art gently. Okay, gently. Try to blend the color little bit by little bit. Let it dry for a few minutes. Take your zebra art. Ta-da! ta da 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 ta da Next, we are going to paste the zebra on the previous art paper. Use the glue to paste it, okay? Don't put the glue a lot. Time to paste it! If your hand is dirty, wash and dry it first. Yay! Finish! Awesome! Do you love your zebra art? You can frame it or decor your room with your art. Don't forget to clean up your place. Okay? Bye-bye!